how to do a good guitar warm up. Let's find out. Before we start, be sure to subscribe and give a thumb up, of course, if you like it. So a good warm-up. What is a good guitar warm-up? A lot of you may expect something magical and uh, something very special to warm up, etc. A long time ago I was uh, uh, a spider exercises master to different types of it that are very good for warming up and stuff. And you know, this kind of exercises are kind of dumb in some way. Some time ago I was interviewing Martin Miller, uh, who is by the way a phenomenal guitar player, and he said that all those spider exercises are not very good uh, because uh, pretty much you are wasting your time. And I partially agree. Why? Because uh, when you practice uh, those exercises, you practice only the technique aspect of playing. Uh, those exercises, to some extent, are just dumb. You know, uh, it in a musical way, it doesn't have any sense. And to some extent, you are wasting your focus on playing. You know, you play just the random notes from the chromatic scale or something. In my opinion, it's very good to warm up via just practicing the same that you practice uh, every day. You know, the, the stuff that you are working on, some kind of scales, uh, chords and uh, this kind of stuff. So no warm up? I didn't say that. You can just play your regular stuff uh, but slower, a lot slower. This is the same situation when you uh, go, for example, uh, to a gym and you practice weightlifting, uh, for example, when you are doing a bench press, but not with a lot of kilograms added to your bar. You know, it may be just a bar with no extra kilograms added in it. And the same situation is to when you are driving a car. Uh, for, for example, if it's winter and uh, it's really, really cold, it's not very good idea to uh, drive super fast, like uh, two seconds after starting your engine. It's not good for your car. So if you work on something very difficult, uh, you can just play the same stuff, but a lot slower and it will be great uh, warm-up for you. Of course, if there's no super extreme stretchings like this or something. A very good idea is to warm up with uh, practicing the scales, but of course very very slowly and uh, precisely. So you can work uh, also on the technical issues of guitar playing, like be sure that there is no extra notes in here or extra noise in here, that you mute the strings that are not being used at the moment, so that everything is quiet, for example, and you can play very slowly and precisely, doing like smallest possible movement here, and giving the minimum of energy to play a particular note, so not struggling or something. Just a simple A minor scale here. So think about your left and right hand movement. Be sure not to hold your thumb like this, for example. Uh, and, uh, and if you play slowly, you can think of a variety of issues. So, that's the good warm-up. And by the way, you can uh, think about the sounds, about the notes. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, etc. So this kind of warm-up is also very good for 
people who don't have much time and they are not wasting it playing something ridiculous musically of course so my proposal is to play kind of the same stuff that you are actually practicing that you are actually working on but really carefully and slowly that's my message for today i hope you like it so be sure to subscribe uh, once again and give a thumb up. See you soon. Hey.